what we have here some Algerian French francs and just to prove that things never change right here we have um, according to penal code 139 uh, counterfeiting you know <laughs> against the law <laughs> you gotta write that on your bank note you know you might have a problem So can you see that watermark? Can you see that? How cool is that? It kind of reminds me more of like a Greek thing um, than anything else. I don't know. I don't know. I just thought that was cool. And uh, these old banknotes, you can see them pretty clearly on the camera. But uh, I like all the little colors and intricate designs. They didn't have computers back then. So some dude actually hand drew all this stuff. Including the lovely lady right there. Is there a name? Do not see a name. That's a bummer. But um, but yeah, here's the front side. It has been circulated, so you got a crease there, but that's not too bad. On the back, we got uh, Bank of Algeria and a um, a lovely uh, boat scene there with a uh, complex in the background, probably a port, something like that. Um, you have a, a vendor of Algerian spices right there. You got, you got, uh, um, something written in Arabic. I, I don't, I don't understand Arabic, but I'm assuming it's saying Bank of Algeria. You know, uh, this is obviously five francs. It's a, a nice little bill. And, um, I'm glad to have it in my collection. If you have any, uh, questions or comments about Algerian money, I'd love to hear about it. This is the five francs from 1941, so it would go into the 41 series. Uh, I'm assuming after World War II, I think that's when they gained independence. I'm not sure, but um, I'm pretty sure they have their own money now. So anyway, thanks for watching. I just thought I'd uh, share this with you real quick. You have a wonderful day. I'll see you on the flip side.